What's up, nerds? Today we got in our Grand Prix participation stuff. Um, so we have our... This is like the premium entry stuff, the Imperial German Dragon Mode set. And then this is the regular entry stuff, uh, just the VMR participation set. Uh, so let's crack these things open. I'll do the regular one first and then the uh, Imperial German second. All right, out it comes. So there's a mat and then there should be uh, two sets of cards, I believe. Let's see what we got. Ooh, there they are, and sleeves. I forgot about the sleeves. Ooh. Very nice. The mat looks very cool. Let me just show it to you guys real quick. Very nice. Um, I don't like that, uh, one, it's a little undersized. Um, it's kind of a small mat. And two, it does not have a memory gauge. I think they should print all their mats with memory gauges. IMHO. Um, I know some people don't like memory gauges on the mats because they play other TCGs, but I'd rather have the gauge on my mat than have to carry around like little cards to keep track of memory. And I guess we'll leave Old Force just chilling right there in the center of the screen. All right, and then these are the Old Force sleeves. Got that gold border. Um, Cool design, although um, official sleeves really suck if you're trying to shuffle them and stuff, um, so I will like never sleeve my deck. Maybe my Digitama with this, um, but I definitely would not sleeve a main deck with the, any official sleeves. And here are our promo cards. They have the little DC1 Grand Prix stamp on them. Uh, this is the not as good Vimon, the one that where you draw a card if it becomes unsuspended during your uh, main phase. Let's go ahead and open this. All right, so it should be two play sets. Uh, one of the Vimon and then one of uh, something else. So, full play set, pretty cool. And then a hollow, Ray of Victory. I like how they did this hollow, it looks pretty cool. Yeah, return one of your opponent's level five or lower Digimon to their hand. Meh. Um, yeah, no, not a good card in my opinion, um, but who knows, maybe it'll become good in all force one day with all their support. Um, a very pretty card. Now let's open the other box. And I'm pretty sure this is just sleeves and another mat. Ooh, this mat looks pretty cool. This mat is Imperial Dramon Dragon Mode. Um, it looks very nice. Honestly, I think it looks better than the uh, All Force mat. Um, but it, I just like the colors on it better. Very pretty. Uh, once again, this one's undersized as well, and also doesn't have um, doesn't have a memory gauge on it, so I'll probably never use this. But still, really cool. And here are the Imperial German sleeves. These look a lot better. I really like the black um, border as opposed to the gold border. Um, and yeah, these the sleeves and this mat came with like the premium premium uh, purchase of the Grand Prix ticket. Definitely cool. That's just a collector's item. Um, very nice mats. Yeah, all in all, not a bad haul for, I think it was $90 to enter uh, for the premium. But I mean, like you can sell these promos and like make more than your money back. Although I'm not going to sell these. Um, Cause I might, I know I'm going to play this card probably when, uh, and BT6 or BT7 when All Force uh, gets more support. Um, and you never know if this card might end up being good, so I have no reason to sell this, but very cool cards. But all in all, definitely a good haul. Very happy with this stuff. I am, I'm signed up for another Grand Prix in October that's run by Top Cut Events. And I just signed up for the regular entry for that one because I already got this and then this mat, so like I didn't need a second version of this, but I will get Another one of these, and then another playset of each one of these, and then I'll get another Old Force map for entry in that. Hopefully we um, do well in that. I'd like to get the uh, promo Old Force. I think that looks pretty cool. But I do appreciate you guys stopping by. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy seeing this kind of content and want to come back for more. Until next time, see ya.